Welcome to the Renergy Tech Support Tutorial. In this video, we will show you how to use the Renergy Lycan 5000 Power Box for the first time. This tutorial video contains essential installation operation instructions for the Lycan 5000 Power Box. You may download the quick guide and product manual from renergy.com. Please open the shipping box to inspect all components upon delivery. Please do not throw away the packaging materials or cartons. If you have signed for a package that has concealed damage, you will be able to repackage the Lycan 5000. Concealed damage is damage that occurred either at the factory or during shipment that is not obvious without removing the packaging. If you discovered concealed damage, stop unwrapping or unpackaging the unit and contact Renergy immediately. Open the package and remove the Lycan 5000 power box and its accessories. To unpack your Lycan properly, we suggest preparing a 12mm size wrench, a 10mm size wrench, and a Phillips screwdriver in advance. To open the crate, unclip the buckles at the bottom of the crate first. And then lift the top of the crate. The accessories and quick guide manual should be placed under the base of the Lycan. The accessories include one handlebar, one RJ45 plug waterproof housing, one power cable, four handlebar screws, and two keys. Please check you have received all the accessories before installation. Next, install the handlebar with the handlebar screws. Please make sure that the screws are firmly tightened with a Phillips screwdriver. Then, loosen the screws to remove the mounting bracket and lift the lichen from the pallet. Please keep the lichen's mounting screw as it is used for the grounding cable connection. Please note that for safety reasons, at least two people are required to move the lichen. Next, unlock the pedal brakes on the swivel casters to allow the lichen to be moved. Connect the ring terminal of the grounding cable to the grounding screw of the lichen. Connect the bare wire end of the grounding cable to the grounding bus bar of an AC load center or of a grounding rod. Please note that the grounding cable, AC load center, or grounding rod is not included in the accessories. That completes the unpackaging and initial startup of the Lycan. First, open the front door locks with the included keys. Then push the switch up to close the battery circuit breakers. Next, flip the power switch on the bottom of the solar inverter charger to the on position to turn the solar inverter charger on. Next, open the back door locks with the included keys. Then press and hold down the power button on the top battery for one second to turn on the batteries. The Lycan will be powered on when the indicators of the batteries flash green, the power indicator of the Bluetooth module lights up, and then solar inverter charger will beep once the display turns on. That completes turning on the Lycan. First, connect the Lycan to a wall outlet or a generator with the included power cable. Then, push the switch up to close the AC input circuit breaker. If the solar inverter charger display shows that the battery is being charged by AC and the solar inverter charger charge indicator flashes green, your Lycan is successfully charging from the AC source. Please note that the wall outlet and the outlet of the generator must be rated at 20 amps or greater. That completes the AC charging for the Lycan. First, connect the solar arrays to the solar connectors of the Lycan. Please note that the Lycan accepts up to two solar arrays. Then push the switch up to close the corresponding solar input circuit breaker. If the solar inverter charger display shows that the battery is being charged by solar and the solar inverter charger charge indicator flashes green, your Lycan is successfully being charged by solar. The operating voltage of the solar array must exceed 60 volts DC. The open circuit voltage shall not exceed 150 volts DC and the short circuit current shall not exceed 20 amps. Please make sure that the two solar arrays have the same operating voltage and are not partially shaded. 
If the operating voltage is mismatched or partially shaded, this can cause current backflow and may damage the solar arrays. That completes solar charging with the Lycan. First, connect the power strips to the corresponding current ratings for the 20 amp and 30 amp AC outlets of the Lycan and plug the appliances directly to the power strips. Then push the switch up to close the corresponding AC output circuit breakers. Please note that the AC inverter indicator lights up yellow when the appliances are powered up by the bypassing AC and the AC inverter indicator flashes yellow when the appliances are being powered up by the batteries. Please fully charge the Lycan prior to first use. That completes powering up appliances for the Lycan. Downloading the app. You can scan the QR code on the official Renogy website. Open the back door. Locate the communication hub and unplug either of the ethernet cables connected to the secondary communication ports of the communication hub. Open the DC home map, click the plus to search for new devices. Click confirm to add the newly found device to the device list. Next, plug the ethernet cable back into the communication port and unplug the other ethernet cable. Repeat the same steps on the DC home app to add this device. Lastly, make sure the two ethernet cables are plugged back into the communication ports. Refresh the page to ensure both batteries and inverter charger are connected to the DC Home app through Bluetooth. When the devices are successfully connected, the link indicator of the Bluetooth module will flash blue. That completes connecting the DC Home app to your Lycan. First, disconnect the solar and the AC input from the Lycan. Then open the front door and flip the switch on the bottom of the solar inverter charger to the off position, which will turn off the solar inverter charger. Then push the switches down to open all the circuit breakers. Next, open the back door and press and hold the power button at the top of the battery for three to five seconds to turn off the batteries. The battery and the Bluetooth module indicators will go out and your Lycan will be successfully turned off. That completes turning off the Lycan. Thank you for watching the Renogy Lycan 5000 Powerbox tutorial and first use guideline video. Enjoy your freedom!